Uganda. In these past two years, 2020 and 2021, the new Uganda, the Uganda that rose after so many problems, has shown that it can stand on its feet and defeat any challenge. In these two years, as many of you know, we dealt successfully with the problems of locusts' invasion. Do you remember that? People are saying that Ezekiel Kumarawe Mere, Wapi Ezekiel Kumarawe Sirozo ntenzi gezari ya kwa wade umogo. Elampure ntenabazu kuru beba singo okuziri ya. Bwe mpure lagu entio. The rising levels of the waters of the lakes and the floods they caused, the landslides, and the corona pandemic, where we, where we minimized the death, recording a total of 3,150 3, deaths as of 5th October 2021, in spite of the onslaught of the terrible disease, for now, one year and seven months. I want to have to have a tasa of fa a key to the day. No way, Charlie, or Monsendara. But I would like to warn you. Stop running around and stop traveling outside. Recently, I was persuaded to go to, to Dubai. I was a bit reluctant, but I was persuaded and then I had to pass through Ethiopia to attend the inauguration of the Prime Minister. And although, the, especially the Dubai people are very strict, and of course we had checked here, everybody had been immunized. In my team, the President's team, we came back with three coronas three corona infections, two from Dubai and one from Ethiopia. I don't know, this does not include those, those ministers who went, be careful about those ministers. These were just my group and one of them was the mechanic of, of my aircraft who was sitting with us in the aircraft. So when we came back, they had to check us again. We, we, are, we are still all right. But uh, we shall have to check again after a few days. And you can imagine, especially Dubai, they are very, very strict. They are not like other places. But still, they, these people picked up those cases there. So. Please, avoid all these unnecessary troubles. Shimai Chemulonda Chemunonya Abana Uganda Jebatero Kuenjera. Minimize, we don't have to travel. 
all those challenges, notwithstanding, and in spite of the indiscipline of some actors, we successfully held the 21 the 2021 general elections for president, parliament, and local governments on time. Additionally, even our economy managed some growth in both the financial years 2020 to 2021 and this one 2021-2022. 20, In the former, we managed grow, a growth rate of 3.4% and in the current one, it is estimated that we shall achieve a rate of growth of 3.8%, the COVID-19 related shutdowns notwithstanding. Because you remember, some sections of, of the economy are totally shut down. The hospitality industry, our, our drunkards, in the bars, all those have been shut for a long time. But still, the economy did not register minus. It was able to achieve a modest rate of growth. By end of June 2022, our GDP would be standing at US dollars about 41 billion by foreign exchange method and at US dollars 117 billion by the PPP method, purchasing power parity method. All this without including the contributions of the first oil to be pumped out of the ground. First oil to be pumped out of the ground will be achieved by 2025 because all the agreements have been signed. All these 